Welcome to Dump Truck Toolbox. I'm Alan, and um, today I'm going to talk about why I am still out of service. Christmas of 2023, we had uh, family over, we're having a good time sitting around, and um, for no discernible reason, I had a coughing fit. And it was so severe that I briefly fainted. When I say brief, I mean like three seconds. I was sitting at the table, you know, didn't, didn't fall to the floor or anything. I uh, went to see um, uh, a number of doctors, my ear, nose, and throat doctor, my primary care physician, and a cardiologist. Each of them ran the appropriate tests. Uh, some of them were run twice. Uh, I had uh, multiple EKGs and uh, none of them found a cause. All of them said, hey, you know, sometimes it's just one of those things. You can cough so much that, that you will briefly pass out. like no big deal, right? Well, except my cardiologist pointed out that according to the Virginia DMV, um, passing out for any reason is, uh, uh, needs to be investigated and, um, and especially if it's the specific thing that happened to me, there's a six month period of no driving. Well, that took me out of the seat of my big orange triaxle dump truck. It also took me out of the seat of our personal vehicles. So uh, my, my uh, long-suffering wife has been my Uber uh, for the past few months. Well, end of June, I went to see um, uh, my primary care uh, doctor, got a clean bill of health, got the paperwork filled out, sent it off to uh, the DMV Medical Review Office. Uh, that paperwork is, uh, hopefully it's at their office now, but um, I haven't heard anything from them. So I'm gonna give them another five days or so, and then, uh, and then start calling. Because I have a commercial driver's license, I need to get my regular license restored first and then I need to get my Department of Transportation medical card renewed and I have to do a, a, a return to work drug test. So once I get my regular license back from the DMV, hopefully within a day or two, I can be back in, in, the, in my dump truck. I really appreciate my employer, Basic Construction, they have uh, stuck with me through this whole time and uh, you know four months four months of the busy season without me in my truck uh, I, I know that was a um, that was a sacrifice on their part so uh, they've uh, definitely earned my loyalty with anything like this uh, it really it really had an impact on me and my family uh, obviously, no paycheck was coming in for the last four months. First two months, I was running around doing um, doctor's visits and medical tests and related things. And then the last two months, really, I've been at sort of loose ends. We've had some big projects around the house that I've worked on. Uh, but to fill my time, I said, well, what, what do I want to do? What makes sense? I've uh, uh, been working on my uh, my video production. Uh, I've also done some uh, videos with higher production values that take longer to produce. I may not have had time to do those videos if I, if I was uh, working full time. That's not to say I'm going <laughs> to go back to uh, uh, boring low production value videos in the future. I've got uh, some uh, knowledge, skills, and experience in video editing that I think will allow me to continue to give uh, you some interesting looks at uh, driving a dump truck and the hauling business. So uh, if you haven't uh, subscribed already, 
uh, please do so. Uh, I appreciate uh, everyone who subscribed. I've had a bunch of people join the channel in, in the last month here, and, and that's always good to see. Um, please click like if you enjoyed this video or found it interesting. Please uh, comment uh, below on, on anything that you're interested in or concerned about. This is Alan, and I hope to see you again soon on the Dump Truck Toolbox.